Alright guys, real quick, um, first time messing with a lift gate on a uh, 53 foot trailer. I'm pretty much just messing with a bunch of things, diagnosing it. Uh, I don't know what a bunch of parts are called, but I just figured I'd walk you through it. If you're running into the same situation, we got a dual battery setup right here. Yeah, I got power going to both the batteries. Check your relay there. That's good. Check the relay on the box right here. Make sure that's good. Coming up. Okay, so what I did is uh, hook your ground up. I'm pretty much bypassing the panel, or I'm bypassing the, uh, the uh, little breaker in there, whatever that is, uh, and running direct power to the motor itself. Uh, let me show you guys really quick what it's doing without that. So that's the lift gate, and without the, uh, without doing what I was doing, that's what the switch is. Not nothing. And again, if you hook up your power to this one right here. Everything should work fine. Alright, so like I said, dude, first time messing with the lift gate, I just thought I'd tackle it. I, I, I knew I'd be able to figure it out. I mean, everything's just nuts and bolts. If you got power, if you don't have power, you gotta figure out how the hell to get power. You could always bypass stuff. Um, Hopefully it helps out. If not, I mean, Google some stuff yourself. See what you can find. Leave a comment. Thanks, guys.